There's one more question, and then we'll yeah, stop. Yeah, yeah. This okay, is from good. Frank Pulaski. Frank, super Hawaii, fan of the show. Frank. Makes great videos for us and he's, for other people. He's He made my reel. He's a... Right. Two angel. people that have never listened to our podcast before just clapped. <laughs> That's right. Screamed at Frank Pulaski. <laughs> um, is yeah, cool, cool, cool. Is there a certain word that you still have trouble pronouncing? Kwaunt Quound good. Quound good. I can't do it. Thank you for taking the question seriously. Who? Klondike. Nope. I do think that I have weird pronunciations of some words, like (laughs) water. I say weird. You don't say water. Water. I do. You do not. Quarter. Quarter. I have a quarter. Right. You have a little bit of New York still left. A little bit, but not much. Right. Um, How about you, Amber? Shalom. I. I'm going to go get a drink at the Shalom. Trouble pronouncing a lot of things. I, I, uh, this is from when I was a kid, but it's like what yeah, came yeah. to me. Mm-hmm. Um, I had a really hard time saying specific when I was a kid. Specific? I would say spapific. Spapific. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's very specific to you. Because mm-hmm. yeah, a, yeah, a lot of people say Pacific instead of specific. And right. Pischetti is. And a then really dumb yeah. people say Atlantic instead of specific. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I think I pronounce things wrong all the time. And people always think I'm from the East Coast or the Midwest because of my weird vowels. Mm-hmm. But I like my weird vowels. I love your not weird, weird vowels. weird, but not <laughs> California. <laughs> Joe, what about you? Uh, infinitesimal. 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 You just In- did a great job. Thank you. Infinitesimal. And Jamie, besides made up foreign words and foreign words, anything that you have trouble pronouncing? Chalapai. Okay. That's supposed to be calliope. Okay. I right. can't say calliope. My favorite word is verisimilitude. Mm-hmm. Saying chalapa. Oh, I love verisimilitude. That. That's a good one. Oh, shit. Have I been saying it wrong the whole time? Mm-hmm. Well, there's my answer. Yeah. Um, I also, when I was a kid, would read the word that means a sound is so loud it keeps you from hearing. I would read that word always as defining. It took me a long time deafening. to figure out that it was deafening. Yeah. Yes. I always get m- like messed up with names in books because I just sort of make a choice. Mm-hmm. And then if it's ever a movie, I'm like, no. Hermione? <laughs> I yeah. thought it was Hermione. Oh, yeah. I, I pr- I've, uh, I've pride myself on being a good reader. I've always been a good reader, but I okay. will never forget the memory. Uh, I don't know how young I was, but I, had to, I was reading something out loud to the class, and I said, Cat- catastrophe. And a bunch of kids started laughing at me. Idiot. Yeah, and I was. It was that. a it was a childhood catastrophe. It was a total catastrophe. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that still happens to me on like sketch team cold reads. Right, right. Uh, occasionally, it's just like you m- make a choice, and it's yeah. the wrong choice. All right. Well, it's time for us to do a segment Wait, on the show. Can you 